my lovelies, welcome back to my channel and for everybody who is new, I'm Leora and I'm so glad you found me. So sweeties, welcome to Wednesday. <laughs> it's Wednesday, we're doing sneak peeks, releases, all of that in the makeup industry and of course I'm just picking and choosing because I personally feel that I'm super super surprised how much is still being released, especially in the indie community I must say because the mainstream brands are really sort of, you know, on a low burner right now I believe. And uh, but I'm so surprised how much the indie brands are still pushing out. Now, I'm sure that they just have obligations that they have to. Maybe they would prefer not to, but I kind of feel like, you know, we all have to. Because I also had this experience a couple of weeks ago. I released a new kit, which was like scarves and um, stuff like that. So I was also going on with the uh, company I, I did collaborate with. Uh, we were debating, should we release now? Should we not? And then we were saying, you know, we, we planned this for this time now and what are we going to do? You know, it's not that easy to then just move everything around after you have prepared everything. So I totally get it that the indies are, <laughs> the indies are actually pushing out a lot of stuff. And me personally, I'm super, super happy about it because it distracts me, it makes me happy. And actually I got to support a couple of uh, brands and also I'm going to get to try a couple of new brands just that I have not gotten anything. I have not received anything of the things that I've ordered. So the next haul, the April haul, will be really, really interesting. I just got one palette. As of right now, I received one thing. So yeah, that is cool. So let's just go over and uh, see what we can do because I don't want to ramble on. Plus, of course, I have to tell you that, of course, the original creator is Samantha March of this show and as always you know that she is linked in the description box so um you will find of course everything that i'm talking about also linked in the description box and if you're interested about my makeup that is going to be probably in a pinned comment in the comment section down below and this is actually my second look with these two babies before we go in i just show you these are two detail cosmetics palettes i spoke about them already in one of my hauls i received them from my best friend in the u.s and this is the neon palette and this is the fun brick owl palette palette and yeah so I'm working with them right now and I think the review is coming next week pretty sure all right so let's go in and I want to start with now <laughs> I never know how to say this KV DV the previous brand of Kat Von D which is now whatever it is I really don't know I make no sense of, of this whole thing so but anyway so they are coming out with this now and this is of course a quad um, I I saw Angelica actually talking about this because it actually says Kat Von D still on the packaging I personally would not have even seen this but yes it's true it says Kat Von D on it which is kind of crazy you know I totally agree with her that that should not happen and if you rebrand and make a big deal about rebranding branding a brand after there has been so much fallout because of one person sort of screwing up um, you know you gotta you bite the bullet and buy new packaging sweeties really seriously so anyway so this is a shade and light palette it will retail for $19 and it has um, I think a matte and or two mattes and a shimmer and a what was it again a sheen sheen whatever that means so that m might be like a satin finish or something like that and um i for me personally of course quads are very very like, i'm not into this at all uh, also color scheme wise i'm not into this at all plus i really feel not at all drawn to the brand because of all this stuff like i know that a lot of people have gone back to purchasing them after cat 1d has dropped out i'm not so sure if that is true though you know and um, I don't know. I, I just feel like there's something not quite right about this. So this is totally a pass for me. Uh, yeah, but th this is what is available now. Okay, moving on to the next, and that is from Makeup Revolution. And um, they are coming out with the second round of a uh, collaboration with Roxy Soros, I think is her name. So this is how it looks. Now, this first picture here, actually, I really, really like because the reds in the palette look actually really, really nice and stunning and like peachy and um, like the, everything is right about this palette as far as I can see now when I go through different pictures I see there is a picture where she actually holds the palette and there I think 
eh, <laughs> you know, this, this sounds, uh, this looks like it's, it's totally washed out and this is probably how it really looks, you know. So uh, that is also not for me. There is also lip products to go with this. The palette is going to be $15, I think. Yeah, and the lip collection, which is three shades, is going to be also $15. So price is, of course, okay. And um, I'm right now not too much in the mood of buying from uh, Make Makeup Revolution. Maybe the highlighters, those baked highlighters with the printed rose kind of a thing on it maybe but I would only buy them if I would find something really nice something else that I could like include you know because I'm not just going to place an order for a highlighter so um that is that so that is a pass for me it, it looks it looks cute on that first picture but I don't know if there is some editing going on <laughs> okay next thing i wanted to show you is um ysl beauty which is of course yves saint laurent and uh, that is so so pretty so he's coming out with the love you so pop collection and i'm maybe you know <laughs> maybe you know that i have been uh, really getting into lip products in the sense of lipsticks liquid lipsticks not so much glosses but like lipsticks bullet lipsticks I'm actually really getting into this and I owe this obsession to my US friend who also sponsored me the palettes that I just uh, showed you um, because she <laughs> she always from the beginning says said to me um, your makeup look isn't finished if you don't have lipstick on. <laughs> Yeah, really old school, really, really sweet. And she's right, you know, and even if it is lipstick that is really your your skin tone, not your skin tone, your lip tone, but better, sort of, you know, um, it just looks so much better. And um, that, you know, that's me. So I just want stuff everywhere. What can I do? Anyway, so they are coming out with, let me just see. There are uh, lipsticks. That's the Love Collectors Edition. Um, they are 30 eight dollars I think each no can't be must be for for four of them I think <laughs> because each that would be crazy right so anyway there are four shades in that and there is also the Volupt shine lipstick love collectors edition that is also 38 dollars which is also four shades so I'm going to try to put the fitting pictures here I hope I have done that so uh, that looks really really nice I'm absolutely into this because the colors look so so good I Seriously, if I would have to choose for one lip color for the rest of my life and one eyeshadow color or a style for the rest of my life, I would probably go for my eyes for cold neutrals and for my lips for red. Any any shade of red. <laughs> Yeah, a classy glam girl as they come, who would have thought? Yeah, okay, so let's go on to Hank and Henry because they're coming out with the Luster Do Loose Highlighters, which are launching for pre-sale and this is how they look. Now, I have swatches and I have the boxes. Um, I mean, more I don't know, really. So they're, they're coming out with that and it's going to be five shades that are available. I'm personally not too much into loose highlighters. I'm very much into highlighters, but not liquid highlighters and not loose highlighters, really. I like my, my highlighters pressed. I really like it. So yeah, um, each one retails for $21 and you can get all five of them for a discounted bundle price for $67. So that um, that is coming soon. So the pre-sale will go up soon. The next thing is from Armani and I just wanted to show you that they are launching a new foundation. Um, this is called the Neo Nude, I think, a Neo Nude um, a foundation. It's going to be ultra lightweight skin care infused foundation that delivers a neutral, healthy looking glow all day hydration with light buildable coverage. It's available um, already, I think, on Sep uh, Sephora and of course Armani, I think. So now shade range wise, this, this whole thing is absolutely off and I hate it absolutely hate it it makes no sense no sense at all i don't know why especially high-end and luxury brands do this that they are absolutely just ignoring the like dark medium dark and dark shade shades i don't know like why what is this you know i hate it um yeah <laughs> besides that i have nothing much to say because i really don't know it, it just retails uh, for 40 dollars which is a lot yeah. And um, yeah, what can I say? Uh, they're promising a lot. I have no idea. I've never tried anything from, from Armani. Certainly will not try this because I need my $10 foundation. What can I do? I, you know, 
I cannot pay $40 for foundation if I need a couple of bottles every month. You know, I just can't. So um, we're moving on to Essence and they're coming out with a limited edition. Um, I think they're calling it High Beauty collection and this is what it looks so it includes all kinds of things um a fixing powder for three euros a mascara for almost four euros mattifying fixing spray <laughs> a lot of stuff um a face mask a lip balm a hydrating primer and a corrector and concealer uh yeah it's probably not going to come to us because we get only we, we sometimes do get new stuff from from essence but only like a year after so for us it will still be new uh, but not for the rest of the world so <laughs> this is not going to be for me i would be interested maybe in trying the color correcting um stick because ob obviously if you know me just a little bit i have melasma and i do a color correct every single day under my foundation um but it's probably not going to get here and if it i don't know if it does i might try it and i might show you but by by the time i get it it's probably going to be sold out and like out of stock everywhere else so i don't know if it makes much sense um yeah anyway limited edition stuff usually doesn't even get to us especially from like smaller brands that are not like mac or something you know so uh, that is probably also going to be a pass because it's just the way it is then clamenatrix is coming out with a new lucid lucid highlighter this is available now it's green shifting it's beautiful i want it all over my body right now please <laughs> please start now i love this so i don't have a price for this one i think it is super super pretty now now I only have a video and here actually I'm I'm pretty happy that it is a video because it's not an obnoxious video it's just someone just slightly turning the arm it's not like super special effects moving around you know so I actually really really like this because you actually can really see the shift I hope I will be able to capture it in a picture in a screenshot uh, for you but anyway you can always go on their Instagram and look at it yourself this looks really really nice I would love to try Glamonetrix cosmetics absolutely love to try try okay the next thing is mba cosmetics and this is coming soon they're coming out with a new eyeshadow bundle which is an all matte bundle i don't have a name for the bundle or anything it just says a new eyeshadow bundle which looks like this so i think this is actually really really cute um is it going to be for me probably not because it's all matte and as you know probably i'm not into all matte looks i'm not into all shimmer looks i want like a good balance i would really really you know i appreciate a good balance so but if you have already something from mba cosmetics then maybe this could be for you if these are the shades that you're looking for um i'm totally in for it that up for it that there is a black and that there is a gray because you can go super grungy and i'm just living for grays and silvers <laughs> these days i'm so enjoying this so uh yeah it looks really really nice and um, if i had something from mba cosmetics already i might want to maybe you know um, add something to that and buy a bundle like this but because i don't so i guess i won't all right the next thing is from clashes cosmetics which is i think i think a new brand again for me and they're coming out with the hello spring palette so uh, this is how she looks i'm also going to include um swatches uh, i think actually this is cute it's it's really what it says on the palette this is what you get happy spring you have basically more or less always a matte and a corresponding shimmer which is who did that who did that recently where i thought that was such a good idea dandelions cosmetics i think maybe so um <laughs> i could be wrong though so don't quote me but um huh, i think this is actually really really cute i i really really like it it's happy looking it's really really sweet yeah and i like it that there is mattes and shimmers you know and and there is no pressed letters as far as i can see okay so it's gonna be i think 23 dollars as far as I know and I think you can also use discount codes here you'll find it on Instagram yeah uh, so that looks really really nice also the swatches look really really nice you know so yeah <laughs> okay next thing is from Ava Lux I think let me just check this um, Ava Lux official luxury lash life it says here based in San Diego California okay so they're coming out or she's coming out with the clueless palette so that's just the outer packaging and the full reveal will be posted on may 15th so i'm really really excited about this because this looks kind of intriguing you know uh yeah so this is going to have 20 mattes and creamy shimmer sh shimmery shades 
So no pressed letters if you're worried about that. And I think just the vibe that I'm getting from the palette is actually fun and girly and uh, yeah, and glamorous also, you know? So I'm going to definitely look out for this because uh, that could be something for Liara, you know? <laughs> All right, um, let's move on to the next thing, which is this palette. This is from Fruits Cosmetics. I think Fruits Cosmetics I have featured already. I want to say, if you hear this, someone is running their car right outside my window. So what can I do? All right, so this is going to be called, I think, the Fruits Melody palette. And it has 42 shades. It will retail for $46. Um, you, if you know me just a tiny little bit, this is my life. Absolutely. It reminds me of a like a deluxe deluxe version of the equalizer palette from from sample beauty because it also it's sort of the rose with the colors it sort of reminds me of that and I think the lowest row is gonna be is it gonna be pressed glitters it kind of looks like it's pressed glitters that the lowest row so yeah so that's going to uh, retail for $46 as I just said and it is already available next thing is a sneak peek from the L&B beauty and cosmetics brand <laughs> okay so they're sneak peeking this there's gonna be a new palette coming um i have no name of the palette no nothing no release or or more sneak peek dates or anything so i have no idea i really hope this doesn't disturb too much uh, life <laughs> Okay, anyway, so I have nothing more uh, that I will update you. Of course, I will update you as I always do. Um, the next thing uh, actually made me laugh because a chocolate always makes me laugh. And it's so nice to have something to laugh about in these trying days. So this is Charlotte Tilbury's a new lip. What does she call it? The Crystal Elixir Magic Lip Oil. <laughs> okay, so anyway, this is a lip conditioner during the day and at, at night it's a lip mask. And it has Hirolon... Hero, wait, hyaluronic acid <laughs> and yeah, aloe vera and vitamin A and A and C and enzymes and whatever. Like I shouldn't read this; it's too hard for me to read. So anyway, all kinds of stuff. But this lip elixir, sweeties, do you want to take a wild guess what this tiny little lip elixir is going to cost? $40, sweeties. <laughs> I was laughing out loud so hard when I saw this. So uh, yeah, please keep that, Ch Charlotte. <laughs> Thank you for making me laugh, but the, you know, I don't need this. I'm just, I just, buy a big jar of coconut oil, put that on, in the evening on my, on my lips and I'm done. You know, it's basically, maybe not the same, but. <laughs> Yeah. All right. So that is definitely a pass for me. Then, um, big news, actually, Wayne Goss is coming out with Wayne Goss Cosmetics. So that was long overdue. I mean, he, he came out with his brushes and he is so lovely and sweet and nice and kind. Uh, and I just, I'm so happy that he's doing this because I just hope that he's going to have a huge success. Now, is this the perfect time to come out with a brand? Who knows? You know? the car is coming back sorry um so uh, maybe that also has been planned a long time probably this has been planned a long time so what can we do it is what it is life just happens you know so this is coming soon and um this is coming to beautylish i think wayne goss is coming to beautylish so uh, i have no idea what this is gonna be it actually looks a little bit like it could be a fragrance but i doubt it i doubt that this is a fragrance it could also be a foundation but that would be weird, honestly, to come out as a first thing with a foundation. But I have no clue. So uh, let's just let's just see what happens. OK, um, next thing is from P. Louise. So P. Louise is coming out with um, actually I have no no real understanding of this. So there is all kinds of like uh, tools, I guess, want to say uh, tools for for doing makeup um, that are like food. Uh, food themed or food based on food sandwiches and what 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 was the other thing the other thing I think was like french fries or something so um, I am not into this at all honestly I just um, I just ordered my first item from from P Louise which I'm going to tell you about once I get it but it's definitely not this so uh, let's just read this okay so we see here the crisp finish which is five new paint shades with a brush Okay, then we have sandwich stages designed 
to simplify the process of building up stages to your makeup with four palettes all designed for required areas of an application. So I guess you can take the sandwich, is that a sponge or what is it? I don't know. You can take it apart, like the layers of the sandwich and then just use the different layers. But this is so gimmicky, uh, really. And just imagine I would have a client and I would take like a sandwich thing out and just start to, to like disassemble the, like take the sandwich apart and use the different layers of the sandwich on my client. <laughs> I'm speechless. Yeah. And then there's going to be a brow gel and a creamy brow pencils. Okay, so great. I don't know. This will be available in six weeks. <laughs> it says here. Yeah, I'm not for no, no, thank you. Not 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 this time. Okay, the next thing is from Sugary Cosmetics. And this thing actually <laughs> blew my mind. Uh, I have been tagged in this because people know how, how I must be feeling about this. Now look at this palette. <laughs> um, yeah, when you see this, you probably have seen my, is it yesterday's video? Yeah, yesterday's video where I reviewed the cake palette from Glamlight. Now I know, I'm, I'm trying to get over this aversion that I have against food related palettes. And you know, food is one thing, if it is real food. I don't consider burgers and pizzas real food, you know, it's junk. So for me, um, an ice cream or and cake is really even a level worse than that. that. This is stuff that I never want to actually have touched my lips. You know, I just cannot. So um, now compare it to the, uh, the cake palette from Glamlight. I think the cake palette had actually a super, super beautiful color scheme. Now uh, this, this here, the ice cream palette is not really my thing, you know. It's not really my thing besides that I just it's, it's too much I need a lot more healing to do um, yeah I can't so anyway uh, this is gonna be the banana split palette for uh, $30 it's gonna have 17 shades uh, with a light banana scent five dazzling shimmers and 12 mattes okay then we have the real ice cream cone uh, highlight palette for $16 with with uh, three shades of chocolate scented <sighs> this is killing me uh, then we have the the uh, ice cream bucket blush palette it, this is $18 for four shades then we have lashes for $30, it's the ice cream lash menu, five different lash styles. I can go for that. I could go for that, definitely. Then the Freesia and Cherry Matte Lipsticks, um, lipsticks for uh, $10, and then the whole bundle for $104. <sighs> I want to like everything. You know, I'm not a, a, a negative person. It's just... I. This has its le its legitimate, you know. They can do whatever they want. Everybody can do whatever they want. I mean, Charlotte can come out with a lip elixir for four hundred dollars if she wants to. Who am I to say that nobody's gonna buy this, you know? And uh, but for me personally, you gotta forgive me. I'm not ready for this. I, I gotta do some therapy still. Next thing, glam light, sweeties. <laughs> there is a sneak peek floating around for a donut palette. <sighs> Way more therapy. <laughs> Yeah, so this is this is uh, coming at some point in my and May they will I think they will announce when this is coming But this is gonna be the donut palette. I have no idea how it looks inside as of right now Just the outer packaging. It's sort of a little bit like foamy so you can press it <laughs> This is becoming too real life, you know, it's it's hard and then when it even smells like me like like what you're eating basically you know like the sugary cosmetics palette with the banana scent and the chocolate scent uh, that's just too too many triggers for me you know for me you if you love stuff like this go right ahead i'm all for it i'm still your best friend all right so the next thing is from clutch cosmetics and i think that is also actually a new brand for me and they're coming out with the unicorn palette which looks like this and i gotta tell you that this is actually totally my thing because of course of course you have your whole row of mattes you have a whole row of shimmers as far as i can tell and then uh, you have either a whole row or almost a whole row of uh, pressed glitters now i like this 
I have no problem with this. Um, do I need the pressed letters? No. Would I love the, the, the row of pressed letters to be a row of duochromes in those shades? Absolutely. But I absolutely don't mind it either, you know, and I'm not sensitive on my eyes at all. I don't have sensitive skin or anything. So that is actually really, really nice. And it's 18 shades. It is available now and it will cost you $20. Um, yeah, that is actually really cool. I could totally see myself getting this. Uh, a unicorn, yeah. <laughs> All right, uh, what's the next thing? The next thing is Davina. I actually wanted to talk about this last time already because I had the pictures already and I don't know, for some reason, the, my my thing that I had saved in my file of Davina disappeared and I don't know. So anyway, this is the Candy Cakes collection and uh, this is launching on May 1st. It is actually really, really, really pretty. Still waiting to use Davina. It's, it's really pretty. It retails for uh, $48 as a bundle or $8 each for the single shades. Yeah, I know that Angelica is getting this in PR, of course, so uh, she's probably going to film with this as soon as she has it. So just so you know, if you want to see looks with this. Next thing is um, from Self Love Made wait, am I saying this right? One second. Self Love Made Cosmetics. This is a Canadian brand as far as I can see here. And uh, they are coming out with these business card palettes. So um, <laughs> it is a bit gimmicky, but it's kind of, you know, I kind of think it's cool though. It's, it's cute. Is it for me? And uh, not necessarily because of course it's just three shades. It's really, really small. That is really, you know, <sighs> Everything below nine shades is just really, really not for me. But, you know, if you want to have something like this in your little tiny going out purse clutch kind of a thing, then, you know, maybe that is that what you need. I would rather take a, a backpack to go out. <laughs> I would take all my makeup along, you know. So for me, I, I don't need this in my life, but I think it is a good idea for people who, who are like this, you know. So... Or like if you have to touch up during work hours or something like this. So I don't have to do that. So I don't need this. But I think it is actually a cute idea. And I think they have a neutral one. And they also have like a rosy, more more rosy one. So I hope I can include pictures here so you can see it. The next thing I wanted to show you is a new foundation. No, a new concealer. Sorry, a new concealer from Tarte that they are coming out with. This is the Hydro Con Tarte C Hydro Concealer Concealer. Okay, go figure. So the new upcoming concealer will be available in stores and online. And this is going to retail for $24 each. So yeah, what can I say? It, it looks okay, I guess. I mean, the, again, the darker shades are not very well represented. There is really just one really dark shade. And I don't think that is even as dark as, as it should go. So I don't know. Then on the other hand, when you see the swatches, the whole right arm with all the light shades, they all look the same to me, at least here on the picture. So I don't know what to say, really. <sighs> I'm just sick and tired of having to go through this every single time and people are just not learning. You know, I don't, I don't, I want to be inclusive as much as I can. Of course, I'm judging things the way how they apply to me, of course, because I'm very fair skinned and I deserve to like judge stuff the way it is for me. But still, I have to be open minded enough to see how, how does that apply to other people who are 10 or who are like very, very dark dark you know so well you know i don't know i have no words okay sound cosmetics i think also a new brand for me they're coming out with the sweetheart palette which looks like this and i think this is really really cute has it been done before similar stuff yes but does that matter no i don't care like you know i think nothing really is new under the sun you cannot reinvent the wheel a hundred million times um so i think this is actually super super sweet a very nice palette this is going to be this is already available when you see this video i think this released on um, april 26th so this is cute really cute i don't have a price but uh, yeah Really, really nice. Sound Cosmetics. Then the next thing is uh, from Lucidity Cosmetics and they're sneak peeking their next release, which is going to be these little tubs. And I think this could maybe be neon pigments or some other pigments or some definitely loose pigments. So that is what I think it is. But um, I, they don't say. They absolutely don't say. They're, they just say any guess, any guesses on what it is. 
yeah thank you so much for making us guess but um that is all i know so we shall see what else they're going to tell us then the next thing is a collaboration between beat by Briseida, i think and latina's beauty shop and they're coming out with i think a palette and um this is how it looks this is all i see from for, uh, right now um this might be the outside of the palette i think they're really not saying anything else here so i cannot really tell you exactly what that is going to be but color scheme wise this looks really really summery you know warm tones sunset beach you know um this this could totally work so i'm really excited to find out what that is but uh, that that's all i know as of right now then another sneak peek from leslie cosmetics for me personally also a new brand leslie cosmetics and they are sneak peeking the bella palette which looks like this as of what i can see right now this is of course just the packaging so you see there is going to be a big mirror and there's going to be a big palette and it's going to be um bell bella or bell uh, how we say it i we always say bell when I grew up, we always said Belle, not Bella. But anyway, so that is going to be a, a palette that is, of course, the Beauty and the Beast uh, related or inspired by. And um, that could be actually really, really nice. So I'm looking forward to yellows because Belle's dress always was yellow, right? I want yellow shimmers, sweeties. <laughs> yellow shimmers, please. So I'm going to tell you um, when I see anything, I'm going to let you know. Okay, sweeties, I'm sorry. If there is a cut, a very obvious cut... <laughs> then that is because I just got interrupted because I had to re switch my kids around to their next Zoom lessons, which is just so annoying. So anyway, um, so we are moving on to Face Bully Cosmetics and this is their Pink Paradise eyeshadow palette that is coming out now. And I think this is actually super, super pretty. Uh, there is not so much pink in the palette though. You know, it's more like warm, warm, terracotta in orange and there is one pink and then there's like a mauve shade but still i think it is very very nice for someone who is leaning more to the classic glam um that could be really nice and of course there are also these electric neon pigments which retails for eight dollars each um that you can sort of play with in combination with the palette you know so that could be you know, really nice. So there is also free shipping on all US orders for $45, uh, over $45, which doesn't help me at all, but maybe it helps you. So that is Face Bully Cosmetics. The next thing is super, super exciting. So this is from Creative Soul Cosmetics. It's a new release, and this is the palette, the Aurora Eyeshadow Palette. Sweeties, this one has my heart making flip overs or something. <laughs> My heart is doing something. I love this. This is beautiful. It yeah, it has everything. This palette has everything. I would love to try this. Creative Soul Cosmetics. So this is now available and it retails for $30. And I think it is absolutely beautiful. This has it all. I mean, yes, I could go with uh, a black matte instead of this, um, the shimmery or glittery shade. I think it has three pressed letters in it maybe i want to say and then there are one two three four maybe four uh, shimmers and the rest are mattes i'm not 100 percent sure it doesn't say here it's just what i can see here from the picture now um i could i would probably prefer a black matte but still i think this is a beautiful beautiful ex beautifully executed palette really really like it absolutely beautiful in my eyes okay then i wanted to also tell you some news about rosewood cosmetics i don't know if you remember we have been speaking about rosewood cosmetics a couple times previously already but a longer time ago actually because um she closed down her shop for a little bit and now she's coming back it's a, a young woman and i have been following her uh, her on instagram for quite some time now she has been coming out with super super beautiful lip products and now she's extending i think she's doing highlighters and like shimmer shades and stuff like that so she is coming back full force now as far as i understand and yeah so she's saying here reopening june or july or uh, late summer and uh just wanted to show you because 
you know she is someone that I'm absolutely supporting because she is really behind what she's doing and I think she is super creative in the colors that she's putting together and I'm super excited to see where she is going you know so yeah that is that Rosewood Cosmetics um, she's obviously going to be also featured down the line down the road <laughs> here on my channel because she deserves the attention you know so the next thing and I think is this the last thing for today yes that's the last thing for today and that is the um, Mrs. Glam Showstopper eyeshadow palette. Um, this th this brand is also new for me. It's also it's called Mrs. Glam Beauty or Cosmetics, I guess. And uh, this is the palette. So of course you have here uh, four face products in the palette, which is not necessarily my first choice. Does that mean that I wouldn't want this? No. I mean, I do have, for example, let me just show you this. So this is the um, Desert Oasis palette from BH Cosmetics. And I'm not really using this color scheme so much as you can imagine, but the highlighters are absolutely brilliant in this palette. So I have this palette standing right here. Always. This is the only palette and if I have more palettes coming that have face products in them, I will have them here right in front of me so I don't forget that I have them because when I kept this palette with the rest of my palettes that are here, I always always forgot that I have them and I love the BH um, highlighter formula you know so if I were to have this palette right here the Mrs. Glam uh, showstopper palette I would also keep it here so I don't forget that I have it you know the color scheme of the palette is actually really really nice I think you know it's mostly neutral with a few pop -up pops of colors but it's totally you know there is a uh, there are customers or there there are how do you say that there's an audience for everything there's an audience for every music you know and this is also how it is with makeup so depending on what you're looking for you know that's what you have to get for yourself I think this is actually really really pretty you can do a lot of nice neutral looks you can go a little bit more colorful you can go absolutely rosy and like also grungy rosy uh yeah I think it's a really really nice palette it's the first time I've seen this brand so really really pretty and this is going to retail for let me see it's going to be for $47 yeah all right so that is that it says here it has um, 10 mattes 9 shimmers 3 blessed glitters 2 marble colored shift shadows okay 2 blushes 1 highlighter and 1 sculpting powder that's what you're getting and this is going to be $47 okay yeah that is already available and with that we are done sweeties this has been a hard one I don't want to always complain when I'm sitting here <laughs> It feels like I'm always complaining and I'm always saying how hard life is. It's not. You know, we are overall, we're doing okay. It's all good. It's just, I, I just need to get out of the house. <laughs> I have the like I'm I'm like an animal that is uh, stuck in a cage and I just need to get out and need to see something else for once you know but I think we are all feeling like that and it's just the way you know we are just being smart and we're protecting ourselves and uh, that that's just what we have to do so that's why I just love to deal with makeup because that has nothing to do with anything you know it it I can still do my makeup I don't have to leave the house. I can still talk to you people, sweeties. And I'm so glad that I have you because, you know, what else would I do with my life? <laughs> Kid, you know, I, I'm just a mom. Besides you and me being here, I'm a mom, you know? And yeah, so I have a photo shoot every single day. But right after that, I'm back to being a mom. So, <laughs> yeah. Um, so this is really my lifeline here. And uh, that's why I'm so enjoying being here, even though I've been interrupted probably 20 times during filming this video, which is really, really hard to get back into the concentration. And then also editing when you have so many segments is really, really annoying. But still, um, at the end of the day, this is my happy place. And I just need this to survive this this time in our lives you know so thank you so much for being here with me and just being my friends here you know all right sweeties uh, this is it for today I hope you come back for tomorrow because tomorrow I have a very very nice video for you too and besides that of course please subscribe to my channel I would really really love to have you here and uh, you will find everything in the description box as I told you already and I'll see you here tomorrow and up until then definitely go ahead and sparkle hugs and kisses bye